You know, I absolutely love the Summer Olympics. To see the best of the best competing, I can hardly wait for another four years when they'll hold them again in Rio. As I was watching uh, this last summer, the men's volleyball, Olympic volleyball, I saw one of the Italian stars had a large tattoo on him that said, my life, my rules. I couldn't help but think, really? Because I had seen a number of competitors who were penalized or even disqualified when they broke the rules. It reminded me of that old Frank Sinatra song, I Did It My Way. I love the song, but the idea behind it is flawed. I did it my way, my life, my rules, or rules are made to be broken. How's that working for us? I'm convinced if you break the rules, the rules will break you. Our prisons, hospitals, and even cemeteries are full of people who did it their way, or did it by their rules, or felt that the rules didn't even apply to them. My life, my rules, really? Do the names Bertie Madoff, John Edwards, Amy Winehouse, or Lindsay Lohan mean anything to you? Some of the rules we have are imposed by society, like speed limits and taxes. Others are manifest in nature, like gravity and in exercising, use it or lose it. Breaking nature's rules never goes very well. There are also rules of nutrition. The real ones are not man-made, but they are as immutable as the law of gravity. Have you ever seen the movie Supersize Me? It documents the, uh, the life of a healthy 32-year-old as he eats only fast foods for 30 days. It had a dramatic and drastic effect on his uh, mental and physical health. In fact, he almost died. What is the penalty for breaking nature's laws of nutrition? Obesity, poor health, and disease. Nature's rules are simple and actually very few. You don't need a PhD or some special training in order to understand or master them. Number one, eat real food. That's food as it comes closely from nature and preferably raw. Number two is eat a variety of balanced foods in moderation with lots of fiber and protein. Number three is to avoid highly processed foods, foods with chemical additives and those that have anything artificial and also to avoid absolutely tobacco, alcohol, and drugs. And then drink plenty of pure, clean water. Now, is this an oversimplification? Well, possibly. But it's obvious that the ideal diet is that that comes from plant sources and from nature. And it can be either vegan or flexitarian in nature, with the perfect mainstay being Sun Warrior superfoods. Now, let me restate the obvious maybe a little more correctly. My life nature's rules. I did it nature's way, and rules are made to protect me.